welcome and in this video we will learn about presentation in Beamer so let us quickly start to go to wizard uh, actually if uh, you are using the latest uh, tech maker then uh, you will have a option to use this otherwise you will have to type everything so then go to quick uh, Beamer presentation and then uh, choose your theme I will choose this one and then type face size it's ok author title and then press it ok and go to compile this is the title page this is the title and this is the document environment uh, before my name I will use by backslash and uh, depth 1 cm vertical space go to compile just press F1 or just go to quick build so I press F1 it's working but uh, problem is that uh, in the bottom navigation bar you can see that 1 cm is also coming here just use square bracket and put uh, your name whatever you want to print in the navigation bar again go to compile just press F1 here so it's coming good uh, also I will reduce this size and here I use large and also I use color for using color we have to use uh, color package so we just use x color or color and now go to compile press f1 it's not running so in a beamer uh, it's a good idea to uh, put your uh, title uh, inside the document environment so just uh, copy this cut this again go to compile ok so this is the title page begin frame and end frame everything I will write in a frame I also want to use table of contents so just uh, use your table of contents actually I want to print here uh, outline so for printing outline just use here section put it in a square bracket so giving frame name just use uh, one curly bracket after uh, begin frame and uh, give your name give your frame name go to compile so outline is coming in a navigation bar and this one is our uh, title frame title name after that we will use our first section so I will use introduction after that your content will come here again go to compile one more time for printing table of content so this is the our table of content and this is the, our introduction and in navigation bar uh, outline introduction both are coming we can also use itemize and uh, enumerate environment here in a frame <laughs> go to compile so that is begin frame and also frame title so i want to use column column sorry and then begin columns and columns so C means uh, our uh, contents of the columns will come in the center just write here column define your uh, length in a second column just write here column and in a second column I want to put my figure so here I will use one package in a framework I will use uh, two do nodes and uh, so I will use here a missing figure Again, go to compile. So, just uh, reduce first column. I want to use only one inch, and this one I will take five inch. Again, go to compile. Okay. So, you can put your text in one column, and your figure will come in the other column. Again, I will uh, use one more frame, and then frame title. So, again, I will use uh, two columns. Okay, now go to compile. So my table and equation are coming. Here also we can increase the vertical space between items. So for that I just go to that section. It's right here. Set length. And in a first bracket I will write uh, item set. And in a second curly bracket just put your space. So I will just put one centimeter. Go to compile. Yeah. Now I will create one more frame. This time I will use uh, block. Inside this, in a second curly bracket, I uh, will write uh, block title and inside the, this environment, we will write our text or explanation, whatever you want to write here. Okay. Similarly, uh, we will write example block. Now go to compile. Uh, space is an integer. 
and now we move to compile it. Yeah. Similarly, we can also write a theorem and uh, prove of that uh, theorem uh, by giving the other command. But I will not explain those things. Now again, I will go to one more thing. Before writing anything, I will uh, go to Kimball and here I will write uh, lipsum. Now I want to call uh, this slide uh, from this slide and also I want to call uh, this slide from this slide. So for this I will have to use uh, hyperlink uh, command. Hyperlink in a first curly bracket give any key and in a second curly bracket I want to print some text uh, on this slide on the current slide. Just use the uh, label. Similarly in, the, in this frame uh, we will also use label and frame title here I will again use hyperlink in first calibrated I will write this label name and here uh, print your text go to print one and uh, here uh, load your uh, hyperlink package this label name should come in this uh, command to combine now this let us see here go to slide number 11 also we can uh, print a button so for printing button just type here beamer go to uh, button and similarly here uh, we can also put one button so here i'll use uh, beamer return button go to compile yeah, it's working This is the animation. So for animation, we use uh, uh, angle brackets, and uh, inside uh, angle brackets, we use uh, n and dash. Where n is used for uh, event, so suppose I, if I write here the uh, one dash, this number will come first. And dash is used for continuation. If you don't want to show your uh, current slide in the coming slide, then you will have to remove this uh, uh, dash. If I write here the uh, same thing, now compile. Okay, so now let us check our PDF file. This is the first item, and then second item, third item, and fourth item. And same effect we can get uh, by using uh, plus minus. One item on each slide we can show by only command. You can also change your order. So suppose here I write right 4 and 5. And now let us check our PDF file. First item, second, third, fifth, because we have changed our order, and fourth. We can also use pause comment, so just write here backslash pause to compile. We can also use text formatting command in the animation, so just again copy. Alert. We can also use color. It's always better to put your text in a curly bracket. Give the name of the color. At least this number should come after the color command. 1, 2, 3, 4, yeah, 5. Uh, we can also use uh, transparent animations. We will have to write uh, set beamer uh, cover in a curly bracket, just type transparent. After that, uh, we will have to write here uh, uncover. You can remove the this. We can also add movie in our slide. 
so just create one new frame so for uh, inserting movie in your uh, slide uh, you will have to upload uh, multimedia packet you can also use uh, um, movie 15 or media 9 packet now here we will write uh, movie command in a square bracket we will write uh, show controls in a first curly bracket you can write anything any text or uh, you can put an uh, image for your movie symbol and in a second bracket we will write uh, uh, our movie name so to this image I will drag this and just put uh, it here and in a second curly bracket uh, write your movie name so I have this movie so I will just copy this and after that write uh, movie format We'll go to compile now let us check uh, our pdf file so play this movie just click here now again click here you can also give the link of your movie and here i write backslash hdf I will go to compile. It's not running. Just uh, interchange the curly brackets. And then let us check our PDF file. Actually, here uh, we should uh, write run. Now we will go to compile but uh, just close your pdf file and then go to compile Ok now again open your pdf file go to that uh, slide and go to this Just uh, tick here and now open Yeah We can also set our uh, text font. Uh, go to Trimble and write here. I'll put uh, Math PTNX. Now we'll write Bibliography. After that, we'll write uh, Bibliography Environment. So I'll be back after writing all of my references. Okay, now I'll compile this. So, yeah, all references are coming here one more thing we can also change these icons so suppose this one i have written for a book so i will write here set beamer template bibliography item and in a square bracket right here book just copy this and paste here and also paste here i want to change here online and this one i want to put in article i want to put here my image so this one i will just try this right here with yeah now it's running We can also add logo in our slides, so just go to Tremble and write here backslash logo and in a curly bracket uh, put your logo. Now compile your file. So here at the right bottom we can see our logo on each slide. Yeah, uh, we can show our logo in the title page only. So here we have to use uh, title graphic. Now my logo is coming in the title page only. So yeah, we can also change the logo position. So just right here and go to compile. In the next episode, we will decorate our uh, presentation. So, till then, bye bye. Thanks for watching.